Hey guys, and welcome back to the finale of Let's Play Tiny Toon Adventures, part of 8-Bit Summer. In the last episode, we made it through Wacky Land. Wacky L And, uh, we had a little bit of problems. We had to go through the level twice because I've missed the dodo. But now we made it to Montana Max's mansion, where Babs is being kidnapped. So let's get going. Let's go rescue Babs. Uh, that... And so, oh god. Really? There. Really? Uh. Alright. Now I think this level just only has one level two, so we got furball. Alright. Alright, these uh police uh security officers are starting to be annoying! Alright, so let's run. There we go. Now we gotta... Really? Alright, let's... There we go. Alright, this isn't good. There we go. I think I think I just screwed myself. Yeah, I screwed myself. Let's start over. Probably be better to stay as bugs. Because he actually can run faster. Really? Alright, this level is actually... Proposes a bit of a challenge. And it's all because of the stupid security officers. Probably be better to stay as Bugs for this part. Not Bugs, Buster. I don't like he's saying Bugs. Oh god, I think I screwed myself again. Ah, oh, oh god. Really? Alright, this level is actually going to propose a bit of a challenge. All right. All right. I said it's probably gonna be better to stay as bugs. Let's take. All right.
All right. There we go. Finally. Really? Oh, oh, the keys that we use. The keys that we collect and we use them to get through. So there's going to be like five parts of this level. Alright. Really? Alright, so we gotta... Really think about this. There's, there's some kind of pattern. So one, two, three... Let's not jump so high there. Alright. Alright, so we got a jump, jump. So, duck. Duck. Alright, so we got a duck, duck, jump, jump. Jump, jump. Oh god, alright, this might be difficult. Let's duck this one, this one. Ah! Duck, duck, jump, 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 jump. Alright. Alright. Alright, there's the next part of it. All right, jump, jump, duck, jump. All right, almost got it. Duck, duck, jump, jump. I got that last jump. Duck, jump, jump, jump. There we go. All right, there we go. Now we got two keys left, so this is the next part of it. What in the world was that? Oh, it was that stupid big dog. Is that dog. Okay. So, jump over that. Jump over that. Jump over that. Alright, that was easy enough. We got one key left now. All right, boom, boom. All right. All right. So how are we going to do? How we do this? There we go. And the last key. So this should be where Montana Max is. Alright, here he is. The final boss. Alright, so what you gotta do here is jump on the uh, that and then jump on him like that. Alright. One hit. There we go. Alright. Two hits. There we go. Get rid of that. You can't really get rid of it, per se. Because they always come back. I had them. And now the gloves can hurt you. And you can tell this is the final boss because of the final boss music. 
Oh, I had him right there. Alright. Come on, coins. Just work with me here. You can never get rid of the coins completely because as soon as you get rid of one of them, one always comes back. So. Alright. Come on. Really? There we go. There we go. And we should get Babs back. And there she is. Yay! This is a fun little game. It does get a little bit difficult from the last level, but overall it's a lot, a lot easier romp. Babs was safely rescued and Montana Max was punished. Acme Acres has once again returned to its tranquil ways. Heroes, Lucky Duck, Dizzy Devil, Furball, Hampton. Heroes, Buster Bunny, Babs Bunny, and Acme Characters. Alright. But yeah, this game is um, a lot easier than Bucky O'Hare. Now, last level can get a little difficult, but it's not a bad game. Nice little romp. Uh, give it a 7.5 out of 10. It's not a bad game at all. But, uh, yeah. Uh, Alright, so for... Uh, I mean, I like the music. Besides that one level, the music's pretty good. Uh, the platform, yeah, I mean, okay at platforming. And the boss is not too bad. Montana Max can actually be a little difficult, but I mean, it's not too bad. But, uh, yeah, I give this game a 7.5 out of 10. It's really not too bad. But, uh, all right, for my next 8-Bit Summer, I, I got one more. I got a list of games I'm going to do. I wanted to do for 8-Bit Summer. I'm going to pick one more game from that list. And then that'll be it from the games I want to do pick from the list. Even though I do have another game planned, which will be my final game from the 8-Bit Summer. But, uh, uh, I'll, I'll show that off later. So the next game, I'm actually, I haven't picked the game yet. I will pick that game in a little bit. Uh, give me a couple days to pick this up. I got one more game off the list I want to do. And then, like I said, then we're going to end it some with, uh, with a little, uh, my, uh, one of my, um, ways to celebrate our uh, anniversary of the series. So have a good day. I'll see you all next time with the next 8-Bit Summer LP. This is DKS3 of the Crazy Gamer, signing out.